ねほほ笑み夢見てるみたいなこの世界は繰り返すばかり感じから目になる嘘はポイテース出ちゃえばよくてちょっとくらい怖い方がリアル超音じゃないけど始めましてつなぎ合わせ進んでは戻るのエピソード恐れないで次へ進めあの日忘れてきた言葉を取り戻せるように見つけに行く旅路答えを探したでも正解はないしどこかに丸はあるの教えてねえ悲しいの裏側が嬉しいじゃないしいつかはつかめるかな伸ばしたてて壊して作ってガッチャンコいつしか自分にな Okay, and hello everyone. Welcome to our 32nd Dev Letter, the pre third anniversary special. We're,、uh, we're coming up on that third anniversary really quick, huh?、Uh, as always, I'm Michael, and I am joined by the one, the only. Phantasma. But yeah, no, it's amazing. We've almost hit, well, I think we've hit over three years worth of these almost. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So that's pretty cool. So, yeah,、uh, everybody look forward to today. We're going to be announcing some stuff to just get、uh, anniversary in gear, some countdown type stuff, some new characters, and、uh, a few quality of life improvements for the game. But yeah,、yes. uh, Michael, take it away. Yes, yes, yes. So, yeah, let's、uh, get to it with first a little catch up for something that's still going on. Our repost campaign is still going on on. The one letter social media website X. Okay, so yeah, yeah if you have a chance. This one's、uh, every 500 reposts, we send out some more seal crystals, so make sure to repost that. Get some free prayers. All right, so、uh, let's start off with a little bit of news from the Japanese side. They recently had a guest join on the live stream, the Japanese Toho Lost Word live stream, and it was、uh, Ichigo from Kishida Kyodan and the Akeboshi Rockets.、Uh, if you don't know them, they're the ones who are in charge of the Moon and Isayoi、uh, music video project song. So,、uh, yeah, we actually had a few questions sent in from the global players as well. And we、okay. sent them over to her, and she thankfully、uh, graciously answered them. And、uh, yeah, that video should be translated and up on our YouTube channel right now. So, if you're wondering, was it my questions that got read?、Uh, you can go check that out. But、uh, yeah. And the reason we're featuring it here is because she is. But she also provided us with a little signature.、Uh, so we're going to be giving that away in a repost campaign. Yeah, and for two winners. So make、yes. sure to repost that if you'd like to have a chance to get this special autograph. Yeah. Yeah, so、uh, that should be live up on not Twitter, but X. So yeah, go check that out if you're interested in her signature. She's actually. Uh, Kishida Kyodan and the Akeboshi Rockets, and Ichigo as well. They've done a few openings for animes. So I think that might be where a lot of people might know them from. Okay. Alrighty, and what do we got next? <laughs> so let's move on to some Toho Lost Word stuff.、Uh, we got the return of the Daily Forever Prayer, and not just one return, but two. Yeah, so for a bit of a countdown here, they're going to be doing two forever prayers. One really short, just with、um, the A Festival friends in it. And then the next one, which is a little longer, about the two weeks leading up to the third anniversary, will be Ultra Festival friends. And I do believe these are actually、um, like only include Ultra Festival friends and only include. A series festival friends. I'm just going to double check that real quick, everybody. Go for But、it. I do believe that's what we're talking about, and that's something that's a little bit different than usual. Yes. So for the A Festival one, it includes A Festival and L1 Festival.、Mm -hmm. And then for the Ultra Festival one, it is Ultra Festival only. It's、oh. not all of them, though. Like, it's just like a certain pool of them. Right. So yeah, this is something special that I think it's the first time we're doing. So yeah, make sure to check those out and maybe get some like A Festival and Ultra Festival friends you don't have yet. 
So just to clarify for the folks at home, the light one is A Festival Friends and L1 Festival Friends. Which there are only a few. Which left, I, I think believe, I think there are that. only two. Yeah. yeah. Yuma yeah, and uh, right. Ibaraki Doji's arm. Yep, that sounds right. <laughs> All right, so yeah, so that's the pools of the two prayers. And uh, yeah, those will be starting on the 19th. And the light one will only last a week, but the ultra festival one will count down until the big, the big anniversary day. And speaking of counting down to the big anniversary days, uh, we've got a third anniversary countdown login bonus that's going to be starting a bit later in the month and it'll be around two weeks, and I do have the information posted this um, up on this one, so it is a total of 10 days, I believe. So as long as you log in within 10 days during the two-week period, you'll get all the rewards that are shown on screen. So you get, They'll you know, also be doing the daily presents as well during yes, this yes. period, so make sure to check your mail every... Well, I should say make sure to try to log in daily so you don't miss any of the present rewards. Yeah. Yeah. And those presents are stuff like a guaranteed uh, friend ritual and etc. Um, yeah, and like Phantasma said, those are the ones that stay in your mailbox for 24 hours. So do be sure to try and log in on every day from when that starts to anniversary day. Okay, and uh, next up, we have something that's a little bit new. So do you want to talk about the new kind of login bonus that's been coming to Toho Lost Word, that'll be coming to Toho Lost Word? Yeah, let's take a look. Yeah, so we've kind of been hinting in like the uh, the announcement posts for the dev letter that there's going to be a kind of new type of login bonus coming. So this is the Korindo slot login bonus. Yeah, so this is a brand new system. Maybe some people that play the JP version may have experienced it or um, well, seen it, I guess. But yeah, every day you'll be able to pull on this. And the grand prize for this is 777 seal crystals but not everybody will get it because it's like well it's like a slot so, <laughs> it, it's, so it's a grand a chance, prize yeah. there's a chance but besides that like um daily you might be getting seal crystals um coins what else we got the blank mirrors of me rebirth, mirrors of rebirth, and lucky mirrors and as well lucky mirrors yeah also so there's a variety of items you can get from this if you log in daily you should be able to get a decent amount of seal crystals even if you don't hit the big prize but if you do hit the big prize make sure to like send us like yeah, a post yeah, yeah. on twitter or drop it in discord because that'd be really cool i'm really interested to see how many people end up getting it oh yeah definitely uh one thing i want to say about the sl like the slot though uh if you kind of like imagine how a slot works it'd be like okay so you line up three say paper dolls and you get the paper doll reward uh you get whatever this each slot lands on so left middle and right you get each one of those rewards so say it lands yeah. on one paper doll one blank mirror of rebirth and one coin you get the one paper doll i believe you get blank mirrors of rebirth in sets of 10 and i believe you get coins in sets of 1500 so you get all three rewards the only ones you have to line up are the sevens for the grand prize all right. Uh, anything else about the slots uh, before we move no. on? No. Well, I guess in the future, maybe we'll do it again, like if reception is good. So, yeah. yeah. Look forward to it. Look forward and to that. And we also look forward to see how many people hit the big prize. Oh, and... Oh, uh, and that will be running, everybody. That'll be running right until the anniversary begins, I think. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Right until anniversary begins. So pretty long, like almost a full month. Yeah, and just in case, I can't remember if we mentioned it or not, but you will be able to do this once per day. So every day from 412 to, well, April 12th to May 10th. All right, so yeah, let's move on. Uh, we've got one, uh, we got three prayers. So we have a new update to our start dash, uh, the new player uh, focused prayers. Uh, so this time we're, we ran these back. Uh, we did reruns for these, I believe within the last month or so, uh, particularly for Reimu and Marisa. I know within the last month we reran these prayers, but for new prayers, uh, for new players, well, those words are actually kind of similar if you think about it, uh, who have made their account after April 12th, they'll be able to access these prayers for two weeks, starting from their account creation date from now on. Yeah, so even if your friends start a new account or anything, these will be available yeah. always for them, I guess. Yeah. 
Yeah, so yeah, yeah, that's true, uh, what you said. So these will always be available. So they don't have an expiration date. And this is just for players who miss them. When we re-ran them over the past few weeks, they'll have a chance to, if they're new players, get a chance to access them. Okay. And uh, I think this next prayer, I'm actually, I'm actually kind of really sort of excited for, kind of because it's like a cool thing that I don't think we've really done before. But uh, let's yes. introduce the... Yukariverse festival. Yeah, like a few people on Discord, they were asking to get like a Yukari rerun for A6 especially, mm. and somehow it ended up into three Yukaris. Why not? But Why anyway. Not <laughs> so yeah, this will be running for one week from the 19th. So yeah, make sure to check that out. It's a pretty cool one. But yeah, I, I thought it was a really cool concept. And uh, actually, I want to kind of build on that. So. This will be running for a week from the 19th to the 20, uh, to the 26th. But we kind of want to do something in a similar vein from the 26th until uh, maintenance on the 10th, which is the third anniversary. So what I was thinking is, you know, Lost Word, it's like the third anniversary, as much as it is celebrating the game's third anniversary, it's also like a community-focused event. So what we kind of want to do is like ask the community so on our Discord, there's a game suggestions board, but under that, we're going to add a new prayer suggestions board. And we kind of want to hear, what do you guys want to have a rerun uh, running up to the third anniversary? So yeah, if you have some friends that you think haven't gotten their chance in the spotlight, or if you want your favorite friends to come back for a bit, be sure to drop a message in there and we'll take a look and we'll see the general consensus. So looking Sounds forward good. to hearing from all you. All right, and uh, next, oh, so we have. I'm gonna I'm gonna spoil a little bit. I'm gonna drop a few spoilers. We have two quality of life updates coming up, and I'm I'm not sure what the first one we're gonna introduce is. I'll see it on the slide. But I think, I think this is what a lot of people have been asking for for a long time. So, ah, uh, uh, the long Aaron's time one. is an understatement. <laughs> an understatement. <laughs> <laughs> So yeah, this way you'll be able to receive all your errands at once when they have been completed. So yeah, something we've all been wanting for quite some time. Little time save, little, uh, you know, li the literal sense of quality of life improvement. Yeah, so just one tap, all errands done. And actually, I think this next one is also another one that, oh, I, I've seen a lot of, I've seen a lot of people ask for. But now you this won't has also to, been yeah, yeah, yeah. You won't have to put each item individually into the upgrade screen anymore. If you have enough, you just tap upgrade and you're done. Anything else to yeah. add on to that? Oh, also, if you don't have enough of one of the items, it'll just be displayed in red. Alrighty. But uh, yeah, if anything else you want to add to that before we move into our happy video number one? No, just like, let's all hope that we get more stuff that we've been wanting for a long time. So yeah, it's nice to see these two come in because yes. I think uh, everybody's been wanting them since release. So that's Absolutely. really awesome. Oh, trust me. Like, I'm extremely happy as well. Like, I know how much everyone's wanted this. And yeah, I'm glad that we could finally get it through. All right. So with all that said, happy video number one. Play it on the big screen. Okay, so yeah, that was the video for our next event, The Beast Dream Salon. 
Yeah, and I know like uh, these costumes have been available in the past, but pretty cool costumes. I like the theme. Yes, uh, I am the biggest stan of Yuma's giant bowl of ramen, which is just slightly off screen, unfortunately. Uh, one thing yeah, I Yuma's should actually. Yuma's pretty cool. Oh, uh, go ahead. oh, sorry. One thing I should mention about these costumes actually is um, when this event finishes, these three costumes are going to get added to the general tab in the game. So they'll no longer be limited time costumes. Awesome, awesome. So yeah, if you like them as much as Phantasma does, they'll be in the general tab after the event ends. So yeah, that starts. Oh, and just a quick reminder: the epic paper dolls are still available in the yes, events. Yes, 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 yes. So make sure to grab those. <laughs> yeah, and the relic especially with well. you know what around the corner. Oh, oh, help! <laughs> he's he's dropping spoilers. Okay, <laughs> before before literally the spoilers. around the corner, but anyway, <laughs> the, the the corner being my finger. But yeah, uh, before before we get too uh, ahead of ourselves, uh, new main story update is coming on the 12th as well so chapter four act three extra six that's a lot of extras that is a lot of extras but so. oh. would you like to read the little the little summary oh let's uh, it's do not it. even a summary but uh yeah so baseballs uh baseball baseball cook-offs sea races the islands of eight have caught the tournament fever but one one girl just wants to catch a break and some fish. Preferably some that aren't toxic. Alright. So who's trying to catch a break? They're so... right around the corner. <laughs> you, you might notice that we didn't include the name of the chapter of this one, and that's because it would be spoilers for this next happy video. So shall we show them it? Yeah, so here's our next friend on the way. On the way. Oh! いとが絡まっちゃった。まともなものが食べられるわ。レム、レム。白いご飯食べようよ。そりゃ。私は神様の中でも下道の神ではあるけどさ。だからって食べられない魚なんてあんまりだわ。気色よよ。涙のそれでも連れでも楽にはならぬ。気持ち、気持ちすぎる。ゲット。1ヶ月100段化生活。お前は私は寄神シオン貧乏神よどうしてわざわざ白霊神社なんて貧乏臭い場所の世話になってるのオッケー okay, so that's C3 Shion and she is on her way with the next update on April 12th and this time she's coming in as an epic support friend and, I mean, she has a variety of things that are pretty powerful, but probably the biggest one is that she's able to reduce all well, the cooldowns of your entire party. So, yeah, it's definitely something that can be used to make some cool things really fun happen that's in important. game. But, uh, yeah, she'll be coming out in just two days, right? Because, yeah, it's the 10th, so just two days from now. Uh, she'll also be coming with a brand new song. Uh, it's called billion dollar girl and uh you'll be able to check that out on our youtube channel i think probably right now 
or at least after this dev letter ends. But uh, yeah, she's coming in soon. And uh, anything else to say about her stats? Or do you want to take a look at her new story card? Yeah, I mean, just to say again, um, her most powerful thing is probably her ability to reduce cooldown. So yeah, definitely make sure to check that part of her out. Okay, so yeah, new story card coming in. Uh, Scholars of Ikaruga. All right. Ikaruga? Ikaruga? But yeah, this this will be available along with her prayer, so... Yeah. And uh, speaking of things that'll be available along with her prayer, she's got three voice actors coming in. Quick audience check. Check to see if there's any that you know. Super odd. And, <laughs> and with that, we also have her versus event. Yes, we do. Uh, so it'll be, you know... So, right... Uh, this is like kind of anecdotal, but you know how like it's written Tewi, but you say Te? Yes. For the, you know, the, 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 the rabbit, the Te, te, te. but, uh, and yes. I was like, oh, does that mean Tenshi Hinanawi is Hinanai? And yes, it is. And I've been saying Hinanawi for so long, but no, it's, it's, uh, it's actually Hinanai, but that, that's just anecdotal. But, uh, yeah, uh, this versus Divergent Spirit stage will also be coming in with a new story card. Uh, the text is very small, but I think it says fishing without a net. Yeah, no, it's a pretty cool story <laughs> card. The, the art is also really nice. Yeah, and uh, we'll also be giving people another chance to get the new Lux story card. For this one. It's just like I heard. So, okay. uh, yeah, look forward to Epic Friend Shion Yorigami coming out in just two days. And um, I'm actually I'm actually really excited for this next friend who's coming in on the 19th. And uh, as usual for the friends that we're showing two weeks before, we don't quite have a video ready for her yet. But uh, why don't we show everyone who the next relic friend will be? Yeah, I know a lot of people have been waiting for uh, this certain friend. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, and also, you know, since people have already kind of figured out the release order, you know, it is. Koishi Komeji, she's here. Moon Reverie, Koishi Komeji is coming on the 19th. Yeah, on her way with some pretty cool art. Also like a very special white cat somebody there. <laughs> and also uh, she's got uh, two of the Satori eyes. Wonder what that Oh, that, that is true. Yeah. That is true. You know, whose is, uh, who's is that one? Might have to, might have to play the runes of memory when it comes out to find out. But um, yeah, I actually really like Moon Reverie, so I'm really excited for her coming to the game. Uh, and she's coming in with her three voice actresses. And actually, one Damn. of her. Oh. oh, I was gonna say I, you were saying one of them you wanted to go over. Oh yes, yes, yes. So one of her voice actresses is actually the person. So just like, just like with Mei Ling, um, with Relic Mei Ling, one of her voice actresses. Is the same person who sings the song, uh, her Moon Reverie song. So uh, yeah, that's pretty cool. Uh, I don't know if they're going to keep doing that going forward, but it seems like that's been the trend for the last few Relic Friends. If that does happen again, maybe in the next slide, like in brackets, include like yeah, music video or something. <laughs> you know what? We might just fix that in post, everybody. So maybe it'll be there <laughs> as you're watching it. I was just thinking that, yeah. Because it, it is an interesting thing, definitely, for people, especially anybody that likes this song as well. Yeah, it's a cool tidbit. Speaking of cool tidbits, do you know a fun fact about um, Koichi's, uh, well, I guess it's not just her Moon Reverie, Toho Lost Word, MV Project track, but her theme in general, uh, Hartman's Yokai Girl? Is that... Apparently, it's it, like I, I'm not I'm not an expert on music, so I'm sure like someone in the chat will be like, no, no, it's th this is the proper way to say it. But it's like written in like a time signature, where like it works in both reverse and like forward or something, and that's why okay, okay. like it's kind of like up and down and up and down. Yep, yep. But yeah, just a cool bit of trivia about her theme. Okay, and um, you know, I was having a conversation with somebody uh, recently. And they were like, oh, you know, I really like those, um, the, the, the kind of prayers we have, like where it's a rotating set of friends that all share exchange points. Yeah, and yeah. 
I was just grabbing my mouth because I knew I couldn't say anything about it. But now I can because we have another festival collection, uh, another collection prayer coming up really soon on the 12th, two days from now. Part one. Yeah. Yes, which implies the existence of a part two. Yes, there will be a part two. There will be. <laughs> I can. Okay. Oh, well, so He's um, I it. do believe. I think. I think they have step ups. I'm pretty. Yes, sure. Yes. Yes. No. No. I'm they do. Sure they, they do have, have step ups. ups. They do have step they ups. They do. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. And the yes. uh, exchange points are shared, so pretty yeah. solid. And since they're ultra festival friends, that's two fifty exchange points. Um, so yeah, there will be four sets. Each set will last for forty eight hours, except for. Poor Satori Komeji and Hikachi Lapis Lazuli because they come in on maintenance. They don't last the full 24 hours, but or 48 hours. But each set will be done twice before the prayer yeah. ends. So, uh, so yeah. yeah, just some prayers to build up to anniversary, basically. Yeah. So yeah, those four sets will be running, and keep an eye out on those when they start. Uh, and yeah, the dates are up top. So if you want to confirm what days, what friends will be available. Just, you know, go back and pause this slide later. And to go along with that, uh, we also have some special Divine Paper Doll packs running for the next, not two weeks, but 16 days. So yeah, just to go along with the Ultra Festival collection prayer coming. Okay. Alrighty. And we actually have one more piece of news to present. Uh, it's not exactly the newest news if you watch the Japanese live streams, but... The next MV project song is confirmed. It's Kokoro, Hata no Kokoro, and it is coming in late April. Pretty cool. I know there's some Kokoro fans out there, yep. myself included. <laughs> yeah, so that'll be coming soon. Uh, more information will be revealed as it progresses. And Phantasma, I think that's a dev letter. I think that is. That, that was is a dev it? letter. That's it? Okay. I yeah. guess that's it until anniversary, eh? Uh, yeah, so yeah, this is kind of the pre-anniversary. Let's everyone get excited because it is coming fast. Dev letter. But uh, yeah, we'll be back. Um, hang on. Anniversary's on the 10th and the dev letter's two days before the anniversary. So we'll be back uh, May 8th, everyone. All right. I hope to oh, see and you. Pro Michael, do you want to remind everybody about the voting thing? Yes, yes, yes. Uh, so yeah. yeah, just in case you were like, let's tune into the dev letter, and unfortunately we're already at the end, or if you didn't hear it. So yeah, um, head on over to Discord. Uh, we are going to have a friend suggestions poll, uh, board. And uh, yeah, just let us know what kind of friends you all want to see in the lead up to the third anniversary, and we'll check out what you guys... This is for uh, rerun prayers. Yes, yes, yes. So, <laughs> unfortunately, we can't, we cannot uh, create an all-new friend and implement them before a yeah, global exclusive prayer of new friend. Uh, unfortunately, that's a bit outside the realm of what we can do. But we can bring you guys uh, some friends that you want to see come back. So, yeah, just uh, head on over there. Let us know uh, what friend you want to see. Let us know if there's a friend that, you know, think that needs their time in the spotlight. And uh, we'll check it out. We'll see what you guys are saying. And we'll see what we can do. We'll, 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 there'll definitely be a prayer. And, uh, yeah. So head on over and make your voice heard. And, yeah. Uh, anything else to say? No. Oh, that's it for me. All right, everybody. See you for the anniversary, and uh, yeah, I hope you're all as excited as I am for the stuff that's coming up. Goodbye. Yeah, take it easy, everyone. Thank you. Take it easy. <laughs>